apate haki yake kulingana na jasho yake na vila amejipanga and Inoro FM presenters joined faithfuls from the Akorino Church in Yandarwa for a Thanksgiving ceremony and launch of their SACO. The event that was held at the Olkalao Vocational and Training Center brought together thousands of faithfuls and leaders uh, from different regions, including a deputy president, Rigadi Gashagwa. Inoro FM presenters got a chance to meet their fans and thank them for their commitment and great support. According to Bishop David Mashar Mararia, I beg your pardon, the chairman of the Redima Sako, there is a need to invest in Sakos. Sana sana kwa wakorino. Wajaljulikana sana na mambo ya kujijenga, na mambo ya kufanya hivi na vile. Lakini siku ya leo wakati walituambia wanataka kujijenga, kibiashara, kilimo na mambo mengine. Tukasema lazima tuje ili tushirikiane nao, tuone mkenya na msikilizaji wetu. Akitoka kwa levo moja, akienda kwa levo ingine. Na hii tuliona ni mzuri tuanzize hii sako. Wajiri uki, chanzo za wa, wa mini wetu. Hawakuwa, hawakuwa na hiyo tamaa ya mali na lakini tukaona maisha yetu imeachwa nyuma. Ndio sababu tukaona tuwe tuanze mpango wa kuigiza alafu tunakopa ili watu wetu wajinue kimaisha. Hapa tu siku ya leo tutakuwa na launching ya Sako ambayo ni ya Wakulino inaitwa Ridima Sako. Hata kama tunasema ni ya Wakulino tunaita kila mtu Kama wewe ni mokolino na kama sio mokolino kuja weke pesa yako hapo. Tunasuhua tunasema, muswahili alisema haba na haba hujaza.